Let's learn how to convert an improper fraction to a mixed number. We'll use 19 sevenths as our example. First, let's check if this fraction can be simplified. To do this, we need to find any common factors between 19 and 7. The factors of 19 are 1 and 19 since it's a prime number. The factors of 7 are 1 and 7 since it's also prime. Since they share no common factors other than 1, this fraction cannot be simplified further. Now, let's convert this improper fraction to a mixed number. To do this, we divide 19 by 7. Let's set up the division. 19 divided by 7. Let's solve this step by step. 7 goes into 19 two times, that's 14. 19 minus 14 is 5, so that's our remainder. So what does this tell us? The quotient, 2, becomes the whole number part of our mixed number. The remainder, 5, becomes the numerator of the fractional part, and the original denominator, 7, stays as the denominator. Therefore, 19 sevenths equals 2 and 5 sevenths. Let's verify our answer. To convert 2 and 5 sevenths back to an improper fraction, we multiply 2 times 7, which is 14, add 5, which gives us 19, and put that over 7. This confirms our answer is correct. To summarize, when converting an improper fraction to a mixed number, divide the numerator by the denominator. The quotient becomes the whole number. The remainder becomes the new numerator.